Hey everybody, it's Blue Toad, and welcome back to Super Mario Odyssey. So now, it's time to go through the Lake Kingdom and get the remaining moons here. And that should be fairly simple enough. So let's get started on that. There's one right here that we can get, so... Let's just bounce off into that. High Flying Leap. It's not a ton to get here, so it's not going to take too long, I don't think. But I will have to find a few things. And we're also going to have to go shopping. Spend some of our regular coins. So, let's go up here. And then, if we can get up here. Which you can just use the pole with nothing on top of it to get up here. But there's a moon here we can get. Rooftop of the water plaza. Now, what else is there? Let's go this way, because I'm pretty sure we haven't done this yet. I could be wrong, because I can't remember what I did last time. But here's Peach. I can't decide what's lovelier here, the people or the architecture. Is this where they, that, that lovely lock lady dress that Peach wore was made? Oh hey, a power moon came floating along. Is, it will be safer with you. Peach in the Lake Kingdom. I think I've been to every place in the world. Oh, but I forgot there are places beyond the world. Yep. Yep. That just shows that I should have done the Moon Kingdom before. Get collecting all these moons, but it's too late now because I've got all these moons. That I have to, to turn in at some point. But anyway, we have these three ladies here. Why, yes, I am one of the fabulous style sisters. I inspire inspire me with space clothes. Nothing about you says space right now. Explore a few a new frontier. Avast, I be captain of the style sisters. Show me pirate clothes, you scurvy dog. Ye are no pirate, matey. Howdy, partner. This style, style sister wants to take a gander at some cowboy clothes. You're about as western right now as a bowl of spaghetti. <laughs> Why is that what she says? Anyway, let's go buy some clothes then. That's just... oh my goodness. Anyway. Let's buy some clothes. So let's go... Probably with the first one in the three. If I can remember what, it, remember what it was. I think it was space. So let's get the stellar view outfit. Otherwise, there isn't another outfit that works with this, but we can't get it here in this kingdom. Oh, this is expensive. There goes all my coins. So let's head on back up there now. If I can. It's not that simple. Okay, there we go. Okay. I love it. I just love it. Everything about you screams space. And I can hear it. As thanks, take a power moon. They're out of this world. Space is in right now. Yes, my new line will definitely go boldly into space. So let's go get another outfit, which I believe is pirate now. I'll just lose the rest of my coins, apparently. So many coins that I could have if I didn't have to buy all these costumes. Although this one's not that expensive, it's just 200 coins. But still, if you think about 200 coins at, the, at once, that's a lot of coins. Let me go, please. Okay. 
Okay. Jump out there. That will go faster, probably. Get that there. Aye, that's it. Now you are a pirate dreaded across the seven seas. I grant this power moon for your help. Yar, worth it. That trendy pirate look. Aye, aye, my new line will uh, be piracy on the fa high fashion seas. That doesn't seem good. It's fine. So let's go buy the last one, which is a cowboy outfit. If I can find one. I hopefully have it unlocked at this point. Because these outfits only unlock when you have the moons for them. Uh oh. I didn't already... Uh oh. Um. Ah. Uh, oh dear. This is not good. I don't know if I can do the the cowboy outfit right now. It might be one of the locked ones. I might already have one though, maybe? No, I definitely don't. That's a shame. Have to do that later then. Just gonna double check in here. Unless it's one of the... Oh no, I do have a cowboy outfit. It's from the purple coins in the... The Sand Kingdom, I think. I think? I think so. But there we go. So let's use this then. Yeehaw! You're a cowboy from hat to, to heel. Take this palmer in for a badge. There's a new sheriff in town. That Old West style. Giddy up, next my next line will be as western as a sunset. Okay. If you say so. Now where is this other palmer that I can see on my... on my thing? It's probably at the very bottom of the everything. If I had to guess. So let's grab a fish. Grab a cheap cheap. Please, thank you. Now just gotta double check this. Yeah, I did get that one already. I wasn't sure if that was one that, that was a new one or no one of the original ones. But anyway, let's just hop right into here and go down. Because I'm pretty sure I even looked for this moon the first time we were here. Because you go all the way down here and then you turn around and then it's there, I think, if I'm not wrong. Because I think I came down here last time and turned around just to make sure I wasn't missing anything. And... There it is. Deep, deep down. Okay, we're almost done. We just have three more. There could be more that I haven't seen yet that I just unlocked when you finish the game, though. Which is somewhat likely. Uh, also, I believe if I can get this rock. Oh, don't break that, please. I need to. Never mind. I'll grab a different one. If I can. Grab. Okay, good. If you take a rock and take it to a pipe, I'm pretty sure that if you throw it in. Not like that. Not like that. Grab. Do a better job of this. Might be too close. Oh dear. Oh, I'm very, very terrible at this, actually. Oh, absolutely the worst. I'm the worst. <laughs> I'm pr I, I remember something happening whenever you knock a, 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 a rock into a pipe. But I can't remember what it was, and I can't seem to get it to work now. Anyway. Oh, wow. Speaking of absolutely terrible. Let's get through the secret area. Got waves of poison, and we have 
these platforms that sink slowly as we stand on them. And we've also got these frogs, which don't actually weigh them down when they stand on them. So we need to actually jump over these waves carefully. Make it all the way through. Oh, that was close. Okay. Let's see if I can get through this second area here. Which might be a little bit difficult. Oh dear. Especially if I do that. Well, that's not good. It's fine. It's so fine. Just everything's fine. On the plus side, I'm getting coins from this, since I spent 2,000, I think. Something like that. It was quite, quite a fair bit to spend all at once. Good jump. Have to try and try and jump at more of the last second. Why do frogs control like that? The turning is ah. I just want to jump. I just want to jump. You know, I just want to jump. Oh dear. If you touch the poison with the frog at all, the the frog dies. Oh my goodness. I think jumping high is probably the way I want to go. Maybe? Oh, that was close. Oh, get over there. Quick, 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 quick. Okay, good. <laughs> Nearly had a lot of trouble just then. But there we go. That's the first one. Waves of poison hopping over. And now we need to go down here. And do this. And if I mess up at all, I have to go back to the start. Oh, jump, 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 jump. Oh, that's not good. How did that work? Oh my goodness. How did that work? How did the frog not die? And how did I not die? That was a weird thing. Hop to it. Anyway, let's keep moving. And maybe I can actually get this rock into the pipe now. Stand back a bit. That should be good. Nope. A little bit closer. Okay, there, and then... Nope, I completely missed it. And now this rock only has one more throw left in it. And it's gone. Cool. Ah, can I get this to work? This is... I, I remember this being the easiest place to get this, I think? I could be wrong about that, actually. Okay, so about there-ish, and then throw. That went straight over that. I'm pretty sure that should have gone in. Maybe I'm thinking of something else. I could just be thinking about something else. But I feel like it was this game. Okay, I'm going to give up on that, because that's not going to work. <sighs> I don't know what I'm thinking of then. That would have gone in if it wasn't going to break. Ah, uh, so I think the last moon is probably the Lady Goomba, so let's go ahead and do that then. And I think for this it's probably a good plan to grab a bunch of these Goombas if pros, pros, possible. I can't believe that worked. But we just need one Goomba to get over there. But we've also got this water here, which will kill the Goombas if we mess up. So if one of... Nope, we got them all across. The reason I did the stack was just because if one of them... Um... If, if we landed in the water and it kill, started killing them, it would drop... It might drop one of the higher ones onto the ground across. So that was what I was hoping for. But anyway, love by the lake. Now, how are we doing for moons? We got all, all of them in this kingdom. Nice. So now, I believe we've just about looped. I'm pretty sure. I can't remember which kingdom we started in. I'm pretty sure it was the Ice Kingdom, actually. So yeah, we've... Oh no, it's the... What's it called? Kingdom. The Seaside, which we've also done. So I'm pretty sure 
We have just about every single moon we could possibly have. Actually, did I finish up Seaside? I don't know if I finished Seaside. Did I not? Hang on. No, I did. Okay, good. That was a scary moment where I was like, did I get everything? But no, I did. Apparently. So we should be good on everything now. So let's head over to the Mushroom Kingdom if we can. We just have to go through a few paintings to get there. So apparently there are a few worlds I forgot even existed between the kingdoms. Just gonna double check. So a lot of everything has been completed now. Also, if I can get a few more extra coins, that'd be good for what I'm about to do. How far away is the Mushroom Kingdom from here? Which, which, which kingdom does it connect to? Can't even remember that. Please let me teleport. Please. Please. Not there. Uh, island in the sky. I don't have to shoot to it either. Okay, it's after the ice one. It's, it's, okay. Which is this one. So I was there. Just a little bit more, if we can teleport, please. There we go. Have to wait for the painting to go back to normal. It has all led up to this moment. Kind of. There's still a lot more stuff that we could do outside of the worlds that we have access to with the paintings. But we're at the end of that, so... There's not much more we can do about that. So, let's head on over to the castle now. And finally talk to Toadette. Even though we haven't done everything that Toadette wants us to do, because of me messing up, basically. So, if we go up here and talk to Toadette. Hey, Mario. Looks like you're on another big adventure. That's great. I hope you don't mind, but I've been traveling the world and keeping track of your achievements. I've also got power moons to give you as rewards for, for those achievements. Oh, hey, you've already completed Rescue Princess Peach. Congrats. And now, for all these. Rescue Princess Peach. You can also see the names of the power moons you'll get for all the achievements. I'll add some hints to the power moon lists, which you can see by opening your map uh, with minus and pressing Y. So now we can see all these in the Mushroom Kingdom, which as you can see is a lot since we now have 104 total moons in this kingdom to get, and look at all this. It also tells you how far into each of these you are. Oh, there's still a lot we have to do in the game though. On the Power Moon list, you can check out the Power Moons you've already collected. You know, just in case you need it. Well, well, I'll be right here when you want to achieve some achievements. Achieve World Peace. Power Moon Knight. Power Moon Wizard. Power Moon Ruler. Flat Moon Finder. Flat Moon Fanatic. Treasure Chest Hunter. Super Treasure Chest Hunter. Note Collecting World Tour. Note Collecting Space Tour.
Timer Challenge Amateur. Timer Challenge Professional. It just keeps going. Captain Toad Meter. Captain Toad Greeter. Touring with Princess Peach. Globe trotting with Princess Peach. Master Sheep Herder. Gaga for Goombat. Lakitu Fishing Trip. Flower Growing Guru. Guru. Flower growing sage. Running with rabbits. Racing with rabbits. Ground Pound Instructor Ground Pound Professor Rad Hatter Super Rad Hatter Traveling Bird Herder Wearing it well Wearing it great Wearing it perfect Hat Seeking Missile Music Maestro Art Enthusiast Slots Machine Cooper Frey running MVP Cooper Frey running Hall of Famer Quizmaster Souvenir Sampler I told you it never ends. Souvenir Sleuth. Starting to go insane from all this. Souvenir uh, Savant. Capturing Novice. Capturing Apprentice Capturing Master Hat 
Ma Maven? Maven? I don't know. Fashion Maven. World Warper. Checkpoint Flagger. Checkpoint Checkpoint Flag Enthusiast. Loaded with coins. Rolling in coins. Swimming in coins. Jump, jump, jump. <gasps> I hope you achieve all your dreams. <laughs> It's over, it's finally over, and there's still more we haven't even done because we haven't done everything yet. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Buy things using regional coins. Oh, right, I haven't done that on the Moon Kingdom yet. But there we go, that's all of that done. So let's head on outside now. Because we're not done quite yet. I wanted to... Now we've got all this and we can't do anything else before moving on, I guess. There's one more thing I'd like to do. So let's go into this shop here. The Toad Brigade runs the store. So, let's buy some more moons. Ten at a time. Since we can buy... Uh, an amount. Like 48 moons from this, so. Just to bring up the number some more so we can put a whole bunch in the Odyssey all, all at once. Oh my goodness, and you can put even more in if you get the least amount of moons possible before beating the game as well. And also do all of the worlds that you can't get to with uh, the paintings first. If you can. Especially the moon kingdom and the uh, the dark side which we haven't done yet there goes all of our coins I love how it pings 10 times every time you buy 10 at a time and I'm going to have to buy the rest slowly I wish it didn't do the animation of getting a moon I guess it's nice to have that since it's a it's a nice animation, I guess, and you don't you don't get it for regular moons anymore once you've already collected them. Just five more. I'm I'm spending a, I know I'm spending a lot of coins on this right now, but it's it's worth it. Kind of just for the satisfaction. And I'll probably have to grind some more coins later anyway. So why not gr grind up another 38, 48,000 just because I want to do this? We're so close now. This is what I look forward to pretty much every playthrough I have of this game because I always, always use the paintings to get between worlds and try to get as many moons as possible before putting them in the Odyssey. It's just so satisfying. I'm sure Nintendo knows just how satisfying it is for people. Okay, there we go. That's all of our coins in except for the last 70, but if I wanted to get another moon I'd have to get 30 more coins. And I'm kind of good right now, so let's go and deposit these into the Odyssey. 
and watch it grow in size as well. Okay, it's all led up to this moment. We only needed 33 more moons. Let's go, I'm going to be silent for this. New products added to the shop. Did I just... Am I wrong about the number? Wasn't it like 400 or something before? So I like added 400 moons or something. I could be wrong about the number I saw five seconds ago. But oh my goodness. <sighs> oh. It's amazing. And that was without doing... The shortest amount of moons, or least amount of moons possible. Now I can finally get to the darker side. Finally, the very ends of the moon. We haven't even done the dark side yet, or the regular moon kingdom yet, so we're gonna hold off on that just for a little bit. Um, I might even hold off on the dark side right now. So let's head back to the moon kingdom and actually get that done. Probably a good plan. Oh my goodness, just all those moons. It's so nice. It's so nice. And it's sad that you can only get a maximum of 9999 coins in your inventory, so you can only buy so many moons at a time before having to keep grinding coins again. Oh my goodness. Absolutely amazing. I'm going to also change my outfit now. But anyway, I think with that, that is also it for this episode. So, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time. <laughs> when we deposit slightly less moons in the Odyssey.